really. And to be fair, we don't need to do every single level. Oh, I forgot to upgrade this. Well, we can do it next time, I guess. <laughs> Is that what this one is? The purple, purple, purple. I always call it the first comes love, then comes merge, then comes late and fake carrots. That little taunt. Let's see, we gotta look around behind us first. Hints and scrolls. That also helps things take a little while. Can't get too excited about getting through an area quickly. We've got to pay attention. Oh, not. Oh, the overall area. Okay. just a box. doesn't have anything in it unless it's like orange. I think they're smarter than they were in the first game. Because in the first game they'd always follow the bombs. There's actually some major difference between, differences between the main story of the first game and this one kind of take it for granted. You think, oh, it's all the same, but it really isn't. At least from what I could tell. I, mean, I played that one pretty recently. Oh, about the same as always. Particularly, like, with Splatoon versus other things. Like, Splatoon, like, whenever I try playing Fire Emblem, I don't get, like, no, literally no one shows up. <laughs> it's funny. People definitely don't usually come to, like Jake that never comes to the story mode things, he only comes for, like, you know, ranked or like league, you know, you know basically multiplayer. Whoops. out when you get to the top. Yep. Alright, any scrolls around here? Gotta be careful. That almost looks kind of suspicious because you could ink the side of that. I don't think it actually means anything. Privates and stuff like that. Like like I said before. Um I guess you can't get that with this. I don't think so anyway. Oh, we did get it, cool. Anyway. Um I mean if they don't come to begin with then it kinda of doesn't make a difference. I mean I, I do open up to that. I mean I'm specifically doing this right now to prepare for Splatoon 3. Uh, I guess that's the way we're gonna go, so if there's a secret, it's gonna be over here. Aw, oh, I almost made it, but then that thing got in the way. Here it is. Anyway, I think th that's going to be something more for when Splatoon 3 comes out. I think there'll be a lot of excitement around that. Not that really anybody came for the demo. 
What the? Oh. Guess I just landed on that. I better stay safe here. Gonna be more level than that. Do you play the story mode a lot? Let's see. Now hiring egg collectors. No experience required. All ages and backgrounds welcome. A fun way to make some Z. Grab a friend and join up together. I'm gonna go back to sector one. Upgrade the gun. Because we're gonna. Well, we're gonna want it at least. For the final boss, since it forces you to use the gun. Max? I could have sworn that could get up to level four. Hmm. Are you not able to upgrade the... Oh, here it is. This is the hero set, and this is other weapons. That's weird. Oh, maybe the max level for these is level 2. I thought it would... I thought they made it level 4 in this game. I, I know it's more than the others. Alright, well now it does this. I mean, I can't imagine it doing much faster than this. could do that. Um, well, anyway, I guess we'll, we'll... Since I'm getting through the story mode of, uh, of this, that will be something more for when Splatoon 3 comes out. In any case... Like I said, I'm going to do the story mode for this like I did for one, and then I'm gonna do threes as well. And then after that, uh, we'll, we'll definitely focus more on uh, more viewer-friendly things rather than just ranked. I definitely want to find a time to do ranked too, though, but probably maybe just for like the last hour or something. Once people come. I mean, I'm not sure if, uh, I mean, that, that'll be interesting to see how different it is. I know you have to get, like, five victories and not three defeats in order to get to the next rank. I feel like it'll make it a lot, ranking up a lot faster. Yeah, I haven't seen any spoilers. So yeah, it'll be blind. Alright. Uh, don't see anything around here. Ugh, I hate this weapon. It's way too good. What other weapon could have gotten that enemy right there? Does this thing have any weaknesses? <laughs> huh, guess I won't bother with that. Even though it's basically ten power eggs. Or eggs, rather. Yeah, well, the thing is, I don't go on social media, like, at all. It does not interest me. 
Like, when you say everywhere, but the, the only place I really go is YouTube. So if, if, unless, if you mean, like, Reddit or something, then it's like, yeah, I guess they would be, but... I haven't even seen, like, annoying thumb... Like, occasionally there are annoying spoiler thumbnails in YouTube, but I can't say I've seen anything like that. That's really my only frame of reference for that kind of thing. Oh, that one was cool. Wait. I take it you've seen spoilers then. You might be able to jump down there and just push forward, but the idea is I guess I better grab the key first. The idea is you get this guy to pop this thing. It's interesting because this thing used to be a completely indestructible, but then it turns out that guy can break it. And we haven't gotten this. This is not the scroll. Hmm. I guess you do play the story mode a lot. Or maybe watch people who do. Oops. I fell into the hole again. I've had to play the story mode twice, basically, at this point. Well, twice in terms of getting all of the collectibles. A lot more than that in terms of weapons, because I 100 percent of the weapons, both on the original file and on this new one. So, I kind of thought I had a lot of experience with the story mode, but uh, maybe not compared by comparison. Ah, uh, here we go. This has got to be... Okay, good. I don't care so much about the salmon thing, the technology. If I happen to get it, then it's cool, but otherwise I just... I mostly just want the scrolls. So, it's always a major relief to pick it up. Well, that didn't help much. I guess that was just as well then, since apparently we didn't find it. It's always so surprising too, because you feel like you look around every corner, but then you don't pick something up and it's like, well apparently there's a corner you didn't sec. Anyway, when smoke rises from the seven rings, the pink fist will emerge from the sea, devouring all the creatures of the land. The Book of Madai, chapter 10, verse 10. <laughs> that's the second one of those they've done. For the first one in the first game was the Leonardo, I think, picked him of the garden. I'm pretty excited. Um, not like insanely so. To me, it's just kind of like. Well, it's the it's the next game. I mean, T Tower climbing, climbing slide, Sheldon request. I I mean, I'm just kind of taking it as it comes. I guess for me, since it's mostly a multiplayer game, I'm not like super hyper into those. Splatoon obviously is the one that I mostly am into, of course. Like if I had to pick one. I played Smash Bros. a little more recently. Got out of practice of that one. <laughs> uh, so like so for me, the most exciting thing for new Splatoon is story, because otherwise, you know, the mechanics are mostly the same. Like, you know, it's, it's the same setup. So, in, in that sense, Splatoon 3 is mostly just a continuation of 1 and 2 in terms of like, the basic gameplay. It's not like a, 
it's it's not like most single player games where you know it's a a whole new experience because the levels are different levels in exactly which, which is to say like I said before it, when it comes to new Splatoon game I'm more interested in the continuation of the story than in necessarily like what most people are probably thinking about. Here? Well, I guess there is, but nothing too exciting. We're almost on our way to the next upgrade. In about 80, well, 75 more eggs. Hope that's not too much of a bummer. But it is. Ooh, that one's close. Splat. This is. Nice that you got this cursor. Otherwise, it'd be real hard, wouldn't it? <laughs> Splatastic. Well done. Think you can make that jump. I think I can. Nice. Let's go, go, go. I suppose we could just sneak through that. I guess. These guys aren't very powerful, but their their shots are much longer than ours. I think those are bigger than the E leaders by a lot. Yeah, that's really good. In that game, in that mode, it uh, it can be a little tricky to keep track of everybody who's still alive. It's it seems like the same kind of idea where I think they did this for the basic multiplayer, where when there's a party wipeout, it tells you that because a lot of people, if they haven't trained themselves to be aware, you know, like I haven't. <laughs> At least not compared to a lot of people. I mean, it's it's definitely more of a thing for what I think is going to be for ranked. Because in ranked, you got to push the objective. And you mostly only do that when there are not very many opponents on the screen. So, it telling you that there's a party wipe, that's a big indicator to everyone that they should start moving on something. Rather than worrying that there's going to be a... Uh, you know, an enemy to take them out when they're trying that. So it's the same kind of idea, I think. Except it's more defensive rather than offensive. It's like, instead of saying, hey, you should get pushed, get on moving the objective, it's more like, hey, you should get on reviving your allies because you're the, you're the last guy. I, I hadn't actually heard of that. you mentioned it. But yeah, there's a bunch of those quality of life that are improved on compared to this game. Like I think the fact that they made the maps bigger make it so that it's harder to get uh, like spawn camps. Because there's, there's like more places you can go to to get out of your, your spawn point as a result of that. I think it also makes it so that you can uh, jump out of the spawn point, you can, you can squid jump out of it more effectively. So it seems better balanced in, in just a lot of ways just by making the maps bigger. So, you know, I was talking about it to, with Jake 
um, some streams back too, and there are a lot of these like little quality of life improvements, so it's pretty interesting. Like especially max making and stuff. I normally take the, unless it's a big, well, 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 I don't notice a lot of these things, especially for, for multiplayer, since I'm not so much a multiplayer person, I'm more single player. So there's, there's less for me to notice to complain about, but I can definitely see where the improvements are and can definitely be happy for the people who would have a greater appreciation for them. Uh, anyway, this appears to be a painting from the Middle Ages. It depicts a great migration of Salmon, said to occur once every 70 years. Oh, she's digging this place. Interesting. Are you gonna blow up yet? Come on, dude. Whoa. All right, where else do we need to go? Over here, maybe? Do we do this? I see some boxes. thought oh, that's what that was. Can't go up there. Did we already go this way? I think we did. Yeah, that's how we got up there. Yeah, it's definitely not me. It says it's an excellent connection. Or not on my end, or perhaps it's better to phrase. Um, what's that over there? How do we... Oh, I guess we get there from that side. Let's go ahead and open that up. Oh. Oh, never mind. Maybe we can do it from here, like this. Oh, cool. Takes two full socks and one small one. Experimentorium, floaty fun. Use the blast radius to your advantage. Alright, I guess we'll start on the left. a big secret. It's probably just like a... It's a salmonoid thing at most. Yeah, that, that's what it was. I, I never knew what they were called. I mean, obviously, they always described it. Going up! <laughs> anyway. I obviously saw the dialogue before, but I didn't pay enough attention. So now I know it's some kind of salmon-based pun, but I don't think it's salmonoid, but whatever. Alright, they're gonna give us a hard time. I probably should have jumped over there earlier. Now it would be harder. Whoa. Speaking of harder... All the way back here, really? Come on, game. These are supposed to be fast checkpoints.
Alright, let's go. Oh, what what is your Twitter? Uh, well, what is your Twitter? So I could. Uh, I'm sure it's mitt related. I don't know what the whole thing would be. But anyway, yeah, thanks. Um, Definitely coordinate some of that more when Splatoon 3 comes out. After doing the story mode, of course. I mean, we'll, pro we'll probably balance. We'll probably won't just do story mode. We'll probably do story mode on like Wednesday. Probably until it's done, I'll probably replace fi that Fire Emblem for that, and then when it's done, I'll go back to Fire Emblem. Even though I probably shouldn't. I probably should stream Splatoon 3 every day <laughs> since that's. I also want to do what I want to do, too. <laughs> anyway, um, let's see, cups. Okay. I guess it'll be easy to look up. Yeah, I kind of remember that now. And like I mentioned before, I'm not big on social media, which is kind of a problem, isn't it? <laughs> These guys can't really dodge very effectively against the big explosion. Much more effective against the sniper. But anyway, uh, thanks for coming. Really, uh, it was nice talking to you too. So see you next time, I guess. We wouldn't do that. To I normally like to do these keys all in the same turn, rather than get them unlocked one after the other. If that makes any sense. Gotta aim carefully with this one, especially with this weapon. But I guess that's the idea. It's practice. I know that scroll is something related to this. Wait, what? Oh. Here we go. We were supposed to do this one. <laughs> that's, that one's harder to get. Yeah, over there. I guess we unlock it by hitting that. Okay, I guess you can't... I guess I knew you couldn't just hold the button down, but I wanted to see if you could, just in case. But yeah, you gotta time it. Oh, we got it. Now the scroll is over there. Go ahead and find the scroll. Or... Sign the scroll. Whoops. I didn't mean to do that just yet. <laughs> Forget about the blaster's power. Just hitting everything as soon as it, you know, goes off. I'm used to something like, you suit it, and maybe it'll hit something, maybe. have the scroll, so I don't care. Oh, we also already have the Salmon technology. I guess the idea is just going after these balloons, eh? Okay, we can get the next tank, too. We've been able to do that one for a while. Oh, well. Oh, so that's the survivor, is it? Boy. One's gonna be around here somewhere. Can't be too much lighter. Okay, I think now it's close enough. Maybe. Oh wow, look at that. It's just totally. Uh, I never appreciated just how far off course those can go when you jump. Oh, 
All right, now we have all three keys, so now we'll unlock all of them at the same time. That'll be cool. Unlock. Unlock. It just feels satisfying to unlock three at once. You know? Oh, that just turned around or something. Here we go. Whole nother sound. Ahead of us. Oh, man. Every child in the home is away before it's our face. I will battle every day to win without face. Come with me, the time is bad. There's no better team. Man, there's so much more level here than there should be, I think. I always just think it was all in all we'll win the fight. <laughs> all in all, we'll win the fight. Alright. Forget it. Oh no. It's a little too busy here, so they couldn't actually even hit me. It's like that time in TRG Runaway, well, TRG Mario Party, uh, Mario Party 3, when they were trying to get uh, John. Alright, this should be the end, right? Wait, is that just a bonus area? How could it be a bonus area when we already have all the items? We have the scroll, and we have the salmon. So what the heck? Back mix? Was that somebody else? Let's see, we I'd go upgrade the weapons, but we're right by the next level. Alright, Salmon. Salmonids uh that's okay, so those are the Salmonids. <laughs> are known to keep their weapons in tip top shape. The frying pans they wield have often been passed down from generation to generation. You can see the unwavering pride of the fierce warriors in their somewhat crazed eyes. Mm hmm. You the squid, kid. Alright, where was that level? It's over there. It's over there. And there's another one right here, but this is actually the boss. We only need two more to get to it. But yeah, this is going a lot faster than the last world. Now, I don't think we can make that. No, we have to go from that side. There. 
Oh man. Oh no. Ugh. Over here? Oh, a scroll. I forgot you got a scroll for your efforts. Granted, it's not the most interesting scroll, it's just... That. These things. But, whatever. Now I gotta find that level again. <laughs> over here? Oh, it's over there. It's over there! Did it again. Octolings Ahoy, Marae Twilight. <laughs> Looks like you've got Octolings to deal with. Octo Snipers, too! You know the drill. Go find those mini zapfish. Yeah, more important than that, though, is... What? What? Stupid weapon. Anyway, more important than that is finding the scroll. <laughs> that can be a real pain in these levels. Got her. One hit. There's Octoling Snipers. The Snipers. Where'd you go? Over there? I may as well get this started. There we go. Take that and aim the dogs up. What the heck is going on here? <laughs> Amazing how passive those guys can be. As intimidating as they can look. Like a silly little AI. Go ahead and get this started. That way we can take out the snipers. Ah, so they aren't all using blasters like I am. Yes, it is, Marie. Good observation. Both of them. Uh oh. Retreat. Uh -huh. Well, we got that. And we have the stingray, too. Now, what can that be used against? I wonder. That freaking hit the stingray. I'm getting hungry too. That'll be enough. Now I can get those rings. take that at some point, but we want to bother, we want to take out the last sniper, then we'll be free to go. That's an easy way to do it, but we got to take control of the area first. I guess we can just throw this here. 
Oh, fiddlesticks. Well, that's not very helpful. There we go. Oh, is this it? Oh, awesome. That was fast. I didn't put a secret. Well, I guess they put something here. No real secret, though. Pandemonium ensued when the pop star Callie was spotted at the airport by fans after wrapping up filming for her upcoming TV drama in New Sardine. She smiled through it all, but it's clear to this reporter that the press for her fame is getting to her. Second is under medical supervision. Hmm. That could be bad. Oh, wow. The last one is just right here. These ones were easy to find. Twenty rubber parasols. Parasols, is that what it actually is? Parasol. I think it would just be a regular O without the E at the end if it was parasol. Okay, take this with you. It'll help me gather some practical battle data. Oh, we finally got the Brella. We don't get the brush for a while, though. Brella's fun. Man. We really put these salmons right here at the beginning. Well, that didn't hurt much. <laughs> well, that hit the spot. Open your umbrella to defend yourself. You can beat the umbrella. We probably could have just killed him before he, could have, he even started firing, though, at that rate. Hmm, I guess we should pick that up. Die. Er. Die already. It's funny how Takumi and AVGN says that phrase. <laughs> Die already. Launch pad. First step, indeed. Have a little ambush set up. 
Thanks for the heads up, Marie. This is why you're the best. Protect yourself with the umbrella. This just along by itself. It doesn't do nothing though. There's a wall there apparently. Good thing that continued. It wasn't. There wasn't like a gap in between that. I put a lot of faith in that. Maybe the the bomb just landed on the other side. I suppose there's any other secrets around here. Maybe that's more of a Mario thing to do. Put a secret in my, that kind of an area. Well, we have two keys now. Forgetting that this doesn't keep firing, because I'm used to the undercover umbrella. Because <laughs> did I already go to all these areas? I think we came from there. I came from there, and I did that earlier. So I guess so. This is just a ticket. That is not the ticket. Nothing past here. This level's so long. I, if I don't get the egg, if I don't get the scroll, I think I'll just forget about it. Get it the first time, I guess I should specify. It's the distincts in here. It might be along here, though. There does seem to be plenty more level, though, I think. Uh, I guess we needed to have this whole area inked. The running bomb definitely helps here, too. Do it from further back. Also have more of this inked up. Alright.
cover. A key. Yeah, this is definitely the end. My faithful friend. The end. Yeah, that level's just too obnoxious to deal with. Oh, there's about one last scroll. I think maybe I will just prioritize beating the level now. Because if we're going to miss one, we may as well miss the rest of them. Or towards the end, anyway. And we're going to head to the final area after this boss. I think we need a sniper rifle for this boss. If that's the case, I think I'll upgrade that. Yeah, I think it is the sniper. There we go. That's how it works. And if I'm mistaken, then I guess I'm mistaken. Guess we'll go to 21 and just hope that that's close to where they put the boss. I think it should be. I think it's the last level, so it should be close to the, the boss. I think maybe it is. It's over there. At least it's, uh... Actually, it definitely would have been closer to go from someplace else, but whatever. Sheldon request. Well, if it ain't the sniper, then whatever. comes in with the sniper. He didn't walk in with the sniper, but he it shows him having the sniper. It would technically make more sense for Sheldon to send it over. Like he dies when he first introduces the weapon. Sour. It's targeting you. Run. Oops. Oh, geez. Look at that. That's funny. Only takes two of that. Man, this is really hard with the brush. And I guess, well, not even as, it's not as hard with the, the flinger, uh, with the roller, because at least that has a fling attack to it. Hello friends, I can explain. Fairly simple enough with the sniper. The charger, I guess I should say. Now these guys dash about, so you gotta focus on that. Come off it. Fuck you, 
game. I kept meaning to post the, the team free demo, like highlight reel. I haven't really done that. I meant to do it right away, but I don't know. Though, for some reason, I didn't. So now I guess a good time would be this morning. I mean, tomorrow morning. <laughs> so it'll be like the beginning of Splatoon 3 content, I guess. Anyway, run. Learn. N Wait, learn? L E A oh leave now and never look back. Just got it upside down again. Are you uh, are you holding the phone upside down? Ugh, I totally was. Callie? Um no, this is definitely not Callie. So just leave. It's dangerous here, and it's not safe at all. Um, don't those mean the same thing? Whatever, just get out of here. I'm not calling again. Wait, don't go. Callie? Callie! I... I can't believe it. Could Callie really be working with the Octarians? Agent 4, I need your help now more than ever. You're not much of a talker, are you? Well, you're still here, so I'm going to keep telling you to do stuff. Let's go!